Hey, it's Sean from StartupFreedom.com. And this quick little video is going to show you how to get a new design for the website that you just set up using WordPress. So you can see here that we have StartupFreedom.com, and this is on the default WordPress theme for a reason. So this is the theme, this is the design that your site's going to have when you first start out. So um, the reason why I set it back to this is just so, so I can show you how to choose a new design. So first thing you need to do is you need to log into your WordPress admin area, the control panel. Now to do that, all you have to do is, is type in uh, wp-admin, like this. And then you can log in that way. And then once you log in, this is what you'll see is the dashboard. So you can see posts and comments and all sorts of stuff in here. But most importantly, you, you have this little appearance tab on the left. So you click that. And you can see that the current theme is WordPress Default 1.6. Now in here you might already have some available themes, other themes. A theme is really just the layout for the page as well as the graphic design. WordPress separates the actual backend coding and the actual platform from the design and sort of the template. And these templates are called themes and you can just choose them to change the look of your site. So let's, let's say that we want uh, new theme. All we have to do is go add new and then you can search the index, you can search the database of WordPress for all these different themes. If you want a blue theme, you can search for blue themes. If you want a tan theme, you can search for tan theme. Two columns, three columns, like if you want two menus on the right. You can fix width, flexible width, custom header, all these different things. And you can search by newest and featured. So let's, let's check out featured. Let's see what uh, themes are featured today. Okay, so there's all these different looking themes. Right, you can click some and say, ah, you know what, I don't really like that one. How about this one? Oh yeah, okay, I like that. That'll work for what I'm doing for sure. So all you do is you click, you find the theme, there it is. You click install, you've already clicked preview, so you click install. It'll ask you again, are you sure you want to install? Install now. And then all you have to do, if you want to go live, is you go back into your appearances tab. You can see that it was set up there. And there it is. Multicolor is now one of your available themes. So to put it live so that you can see it on your site, you press activate. New theme activated. So all you have to do is click on your site, refresh it. Yeah, so then you can see here's your new site with the new design. Pretty easy and pretty cool, huh? It's, so it's that simple, the, w the way to choose themes. You can also Google um, free WordPress themes online, and um, you can find thousands of themes that way. And all you do is you download the file, and you upload it to your, fol your folder where all your websites are, and then that theme shows up, so that's easy as well. And to upload files to a folder, I, I'll have to ask you to refer back to the last video I did because that shows you how to access that back-end folder system on your website hosting. So that's it. So you can choose themes until the cows come home. Uh, hopefully this has helped you out, and I'll talk to you soon.